This is a gumball machine that I built almost entirely out of cardboard. The way it works is you dispense gumballs by pressing this button here. However, this is also a pinball machine and I've designed it in a way so that it only dispenses gumballs if you're able to shoot the ball into this hole. So once you insert 25 cents, you can twist this lever which will dispense a marble for the pinball machine. If you win, you are rewarded with a gumball, but if you lose, either by shooting it into the loose hole or the ball falling into the gutter, then nothing comes out. By the way, this lever is coin operated, so anytime you try twisting it without putting any money in, or putting in the wrong amount of money, then nothing comes out. Well, now that I've showed you all how this works, you're probably wondering what's inside. You're probably wondering what's inside. Alright, well if you've watched all the way through then you've probably seen a glimpse or two of the inside, but you haven't really seen anything up close. So let me show you how this thing works. So the coin rejection system is pretty simple. All it is is a hole that is big enough to let the smaller coins fall through it, but just small enough to let a quarter pass through. Here is a closer look of that marble dispenser, so basically what's happening here is, uh, well without a coin you can't twist it far enough to tip the marble out. So what the coin does is it lifts that bar high enough to where it can bypass that stop block, and once it does the marble falls out and so does the coin, and the whole thing just kind of resets itself so that you can only get one marble per 25 cents. Alright and here is how the flipper mechanism works, it's pretty self explanatory I think. Now for the gumball dispenser, so this whole contraption can actually come out, it's just held in by these really tiny but strong magnets, so once you disconnect the magnet you can just take this whole thing out. And so this thing is kind of elaborate, but for starters this is where the gumballs go and they all just funnel into here. And so basically what prevents you from being able to dispense gumballs without actually winning is, uh, well without a marble the lever can't reach the bar that holds the gumballs. But once a marble gets shot into the wind hole, that marble will roll down this ramp and into the funnel here. And the added extra height and length of that marble will nudge that bar forward which is what dispenses the gumball. Also one thing you might notice is uh, once you push the lever, that marble falls through a hole which essentially keeps you from being able to push the lever over and over to get more than one gumball at a time. If the marble falls down the gutter, it will roll down this ramp and if it goes down the lose hole, it will roll down this ramp. If you enjoyed this video, click or tap the screen to check out this giant two-player pinball machine that I built out of cardboard. Also, if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing if you want to keep seeing me make cool stuff. Alright, that's it for today. I'll see you in that two-player pinball machine video. Click it, please. Click, click it. I need, I need views, please.